Hello everyone, Just Frank coming to you from the Just Frank Golf Academy YouTube channel. I appreciate you watching and I want to talk to you about the role of the right arm in the golf swing and how important it is and how people overlook it, neglect it, and the function of the right arm because so many people have been told to pull with the left for so long and that the right arm is just on, on, its, uh, on the way for the ride and, and I, I don't quite believe that. Um, I believe the right arm plays a major function in the golf swing, and it's something that you could work on. And so what I see a lot of people do is when they take the club back, they get back to about parallel to the ground, and then all of a sudden their arms break apart, okay? And they become very narrow in their back swing, uh, something I see a lot. And this can all be solved with a really easy way to move the right arm in the back swing. And so my whole goal for you is to, so when the club gets here, how are we supposed to get it to the top of the swing in a really good position? How is the top of the swing supposed to get there? And what's the role of the right arm? Well, very simple. Right away, you can understand the role of the right arm because what happens is that basically you can see my right palm is face to the ground right here. So my next move from here is really simple. It's just turning the right palm to the sky. So if you go back, turn the right palm to the sky, that club is going to be in a phenomenal position when you take the club back. And I see so many players that get really across the line, at, at um, and then they get real steep, and then they have to do something weird to shell out their body. But this is the, this is the key roll of the right arm for me. Roll it, and you can see where that club gets in a really good spot. What it also does is it keeps that right arm from going way out away from you, club getting real steep um, and, and real steep down in the downswing. So it keeps that right arm tucked. And then from here, what happens, what I love about this, um, what I love about this right arm roll is that it can produce a ton of power in your golf game. This is a trick that you can apply to your game immediately to help you gain more yardage. And what I'm going to tell you is that if I take my arm back and I just turn my arm this way, kind of counterclockwise rotate it up like this. So you can see is that my palm is actually facing the camera. Okay. What's going to happen is I have to find some way to shallow this back down. Okay. Because normally when my hand's up here, most people don't have time or the skill or ability to do that motion to get yourself back here. And there's also a whole host of other things that can go wrong. So what happens, they get the arm up here, and what happens is that there's no way for them to do what I like to call as the punch and extend motion. So what happens is that if their hand's up like this, they're actually going to come out of their shot, and they're probably going to top it and get really shallow and hit the balls to the right. So if I take my right arm, and I have that palm to the sky with my right, uh, with my right arm close, uh, close to my body here. What I can do from here is that I can go ahead and extend my left arm and punch and punch down, bam, like this. You are you are gaining tons of speed and momentum by doing that. It's almost like a karate move or a karate punch. So if my hand is to the sky here, my arms in you know pretty close to my body. I'm going to extend my left knee. Here, I'll back up so you can see. I'm going to extend my left knee and boom. I'm going to... So there's a lot of pump and power there. So this is something, the role of the right arm is crucial for you. So it's the takeaway. It's understanding how the takeaway of the right arm, where it goes, how to get the club to the top of your backswing. And from here, it's understanding where that punch comes from. So you can get that club right from here and then punch and you can see you can see right here that my right arm is extended it's actually a little workout there too my right arm is extended and you can see where my right hand is covering my left hand my left arm is still above my right arm right here i've got good tilt in my shoulders and i've got a little bit of a bow in my left wrist or a flat left wrist so there's so many good things that come out of this. And understanding the role of the right arm is crucial. The best players in the world do this. The best players in the world rarely take the club back, get it across the line with their arms away from their body, you know, with no, um, no type of organization. 
and then they come steep. I see more, maybe the elite player can get away with this, but for the average player who plays once a week and doesn't practice very often, getting the club across the line with their arms open or, you know, arms far apart, all it does is steep in the club and then you got to shallow it with a couple of different body moves. So the right arm is crucial. Take the club here, extend the right arm. Take the club here, extend the right arm. So the club goes back actually to um, position three. Boom, like this. And you can really develop some speed and some power and some compression with the roll of the right arm and understanding that. So what happens is that, you know, if I was going to punch somebody, I would not keep my arm out here and swing this way. I keep my arm in tight. Boom, I'd extend my left leg and I'd turn through. So there's my power position. So again, the roll of the right arm, crucial. I know it can help your game. If you really like this video, please hit the subscribe button. Uh, please like the video and comment. Please also comment so I know what else I can help you guys with and cover and, um, and, and help you play better golf. So this is a great little action and a great, great little reminder for no matter what level player you're at. You're at a beginner level, you're at somebody who is um, just starting the game, uh, or just you know wants to go from being a 15 handicap to a, a single digit handicap. This will really help you gain some distance as well. Distance, compression, um, definitely something that I know that can help your game. The roll of the right arm, crucial, your trail arm. If you're a left-handed golfer, of course, it'd be your left arm. But, but the roll of the right arm for me as a right-handed golfer uh, has really um, kind of put me in a position to hit the ball farther, compress it, and, and control the golf ball as well. So our goal is to compress it, hit the ground in the same spot every time, uh, control the, the direction, and, can, and, and get as much distance as you can. And so these three things are definitely covered by the proper motion of the right arm. So my name is Jess Frank. I'm a PGA teaching professional. I've been teaching golf for over 20 years. Hope this helps your game. Uh, again, please go ahead and hit the subscribe button and we will uh, see you soon. So thanks for watching.